zomygodatcj.com. Hey guys, this is Clinton Jeff from zomygodatcj.com. And today we're going to take a little look at email on the Nokia N900. Now, the Nokia N900's client actually handles email very, very well. Um, you can subscribe to a new account just by going and selecting new account over there. Uh, which will take you to the account setup. All you have to do is press next and let it check for service availability. Once it does that, all you have to do is select your region, which could be anything. Once you do that, you can select your service provider right there. As you can see, there's Mail for Exchange, Nokia Messaging, Dot Mac, AIM, um, AOL, Gmail, Hotmail, whole bunch of email addresses over there that you can um, choose as your service. So once you enter your service in, you can just press done to um, proceed. Now we have a Nokia messaging account, so we configured it with our Nokia messaging account, which pulls in a bunch of our emails there. When you tap on the name of an email address, it'll open it up and show your inbox drafts outbox and sent items. You can tap on the inbox to see any new um, emails you have which will be um, distinguished in a bluish uh, tint over there. Tap that up and it will show you your email. Now there is support for HTML so you can see that it shows up over there. Um, all the images show up pretty fine. From here you can either choose to email uh, a reply to them Forward the email, delete the email, or choose to turn images off. You can also go to the next email or go back in email. Um, you can also tap on the bar on the top to select find in message. To mark the message as unread, add the message uh, email address to your contacts. To move the message, choose a new message or check out the message details. You can also long press on a message to delete it or mark it as unread. You can also compose a new message just by pressing the new message bar over there. And this is pretty much how it looks. You can type in any um, content you want with the N900's keyboard. This has all the default um, basic email features you would expect, um, such as showing your BCC or your CC, adding an attachment, message settings, or a final message. Um, all the basics are running. Right At the mail email window, you can also check out your settings where you you can choose your default account, your new message format. Um, you can also choose when to update your IMAP and POP3 accounts. You can also edit your email accounts. For example, here is our Nokia messaging account where you can check out your service info um, and edit your synchronization settings right there. Nokia messaging has recently also allowed you to keep uh, messages in your inbox that are older than a month so they won't hide them from your view on the N900. So that's basically it for email on the Nokia N900. For more on this topic, you can check out our post on zomygod.cj.com. If you have any comments, do let us know in the comment section below.